In the mornings, we start at 7.30 with high school students that are dually enrolled in college credits. And we are open until 10 p.m. when we have adults who are working full-time and returning to school to earn uh, various kinds of college credit. So we are always in transition in all of our facilities, and that is an integral part of uh, what we do, and certainly a part of the design that Dewberry worked with us to, to create something that would be effective. When you tell people flexible classrooms, the first thing people say is, I need a wall that I can move to one side or the other to make the classroom bigger or smaller. And in theory, that's not the way to approach the problem. So we approached it in two ways. Is one, to give a teacher as many teaching opportunities in a classroom as we could, whether that be whiteboards, smart boards, um, video conferencing, the ability to move furniture, things like that. But then it was also the ability to provide different size classrooms. We have traditional classrooms that would hold 30, but they're just designed in a different way that allows them to be very flexible. But we also have classrooms that are designed for four to six to eight students. One of the things we offer is a tremendous amount of flexibility. People can find a space that they are really comfortable in for teaching, for learning, and they can make the, the classroom flexible. They can move it around so that it accommodates group projects or it can accommodate traditional lecture or a lot of different setups so that really any space you have can meet your needs. 